Beyonce, The Weeknd, and Eminem are just a few of the big names playing over the next two weekends at the Coachella Music Festival in Indio. Ah, what a great lineup. Yeah, it's the <laughs> first major outdoor festival since the Las Vegas massacre last October. And, of course, security will be a top priority. kk Tina Patel is live in Eastvale with details on how festival fans will be kept safe at this venue. Tina? Well, Coachella's been going on for nearly two decades now, so police there say they know what they're doing, and they say they are constantly looking at other large-scale events to learn how they can make security even better. Music lovers around Southern California are getting ready for Coachella. They say there's nothing like seeing your favorite artists in a festival setting. It's just being there, being around the people, the atmosphere, the energy from the music, it's it's fun. But it's also a little scary thinking about what happened at the Route 91 Music Festival in Las Vegas just six months ago. No, that, that was crazy and it's like, it's crazy how it all went about because I mean, if you're at that kind of place, it's all fun. You're all in the moment, you know. Before it was a, f a place to get like away from distraction, to have freedom. Now you're kind of thinking about like, what if I'm going to my last, my final destination? But police say attendees should not worry. 14 law enforcement agencies at the local, state, and federal level will be working together this weekend to keep all 125,000 people safe. They say they didn't make any changes just because of the Las Vegas shooting. We look at uh, worldwide events and cert and we evaluate risks. You know, we don't have any high rises around there, which was really the issue. But for the first time this year, they will be using drones to keep an eye on the far ends of the festival grounds and to monitor crowds. I think it'll even help us more with traffic for communities. If they can't get there, why is it stuck? What's happening? What's going on in that spot? Boom, we can send a drone up. India police officers also started carrying tourniquet kits like this one a few months ago, which can be utilized if there is a shooting or any other kind of medical emergency. Attendees will have to go through metal detectors and have their bags searched. Some people say that used to bother them, but now they say they understand the need for extra protection. And it's always going to be irritating because you just want to go in and out, but at the end of the day, your safety is what you're most what you value the most. So you can't you can never question the safety. Now, police advise people to go in and look at where all the exits are. Know that they also say that if you're going with a group of friends, pick a meeting spot ahead of time so you know what to do if you get separated. And of course, they say if you see anything suspicious, say something. We'll send it back to you. Of course.